About 3,000 police officers are on the hunt for France's most famous criminal after he broke out of prison Sunday in a scene that looked like something out of a Hollywood movie. CBS's Charlie Dagena is in London with more on the daring escape. Inmates can be heard cheering from inside the jail. You can just about make out the helicopter flying off into the distance. On board, notorious French gangster Redouane Faïd. Here's how the brazen jailbreak went down. Heavily armed men took a terrified flight instructor hostage at a nearby flying club, hijacking his helicopter. They forced him to land at the one part of the prison that did not have anti aircraft netting. Armed with assault rifles, two masked men used smoke bombs and power tools to make their way to the visiting room where Faid was meeting his brother. The wardens weren't about to argue. The getaway was over in less than 10 minutes without a shot being fired. Police found the chopper dumped by a highway around 40 miles away. The insides torched. The pilot shocked but unharmed. Later, two getaway cars were found torched too, one abandoned in a shopping center garage. France's most famous gangster said he modeled his heist on Hollywood crime thriller films like he. Your money's insured by the federal government, you're not going to lose a dime. Even personally thanking movie director Michael Mann for being his technical advisor. Faid was serving a 25 year sentence for a botched robbery in which a young policewoman was killed, though Faid said he had nothing to do with her death. And Faid has managed to escape before, blowing his way out of prison using explosives hidden in packs of tissues. He was hunted down six weeks later. Charlie Daggett, CBS News. France's justice minister says investigators believe drones seen months ago buzzing above a prison may have been linked to that brazen escape.